All right. Yeah. Oh, that's not good. There we go. That's better. Um, hello, everyone. Uh, welcome to a brand new series on my brand new channel. Uh, this is Iskadar's Travels in Terra Firma Craft. Um, Terra Firma Craft, of course, being a more realistic, more hardcore type survival mod uh, for Minecraft. Um, yes. Uh, so hello to all my old subscribers, all my old viewers, and hello to anybody new who stops by and decides to check in. Um, you know, right now I'm doing a little Minecraft, a little Terra Firma Craft, but there will be more games on this channel. I do promise you, I'm not sure what yet, but we'll find new stuff to do. Um, so, uh, first off, let me tell you what's going on here. Uh, this is, of course, Terra Firma Craft, uh, build 77 on Minecraft 1.62. Uh, I've got Zan's mini map because Ray's doesn't work well with Terra Firmacraft. Uh, extra Firmacraft, um, which has a few things like Adobe bricks and lanterns. Uh, what else do I got? Damage indicators and an EI. Yep, yep. I, I do believe I got a recipe. No, I don't. I have it on cheat. Okay, let's fix that. Um, there we go. That's better. All right. So, let's go ahead and get this thing started. Let me go ahead and tell you a little bit about, ter about Terra Firmacraft. Um, you know, if you're familiar at all with Minecraft, you know the very first thing you do, you start out, and you punch trees, you get wood, you make wood tools, then you make stone tools. Uh, Terra Firmacraft? Not so much. I can sit here and do this all day, and absolutely crap all will happen. Nope. Uh, wooden tools do not exist in Terra Firma Craft. Um, you can also uh, tell that the uh, land generation is a little different too. Uh, there's a lot more uh, dirt, um, dirt types, sand types, a lot more different types of trees, um, stone, metals, and, and ore. Uh, all for you to explore and find, and a whole shed load of new crops as well. Um, now you may be thinking, uh, if I can't make, you know, wooden tools, how do you get started? Well, you go along and you pick up rocks from the ground. Dolomite, in this case. There are a lot of different types of rocks, and they have all of these neat little, um, and they keep track of how hard the rock is. you got stuff like chalk, which is very soft. Oh, up to, I think, um, um, what is it? It's black. It's, um, basalt, I think you call it. Which is, I think it's the hardest. Salt and granite, of course. So, and there we go. There we go. So now I have 16 rocks. And much like they used to way back when, um, to make any tools, you bang rocks together. In this case, by right clicking. Do -do. Oops, did I just screw that up? Um. Oh, boop, boop. I'm doing good today. Yep. Wasted that. What well, wasted those rocks, didn't I? Try that. Nope. Oh, there we go. That got it. Knife blade. So it was that way, huh? Yeah. All right. Two. And you make you can make knife blades in pairs. Um. And of course, I now need an axe. Like so. Axe head. Let's get our axe head because we can. Um, you basically have to memorize these patterns. And I don't know them all. But, and let's get a second one of those because that's useful. There we go. These are your most of your stone tools. You got stone javelins, which you can throw, um, stone axes, and stone knives. You also got stone shovels and stone hoes, but on their own, they're not very useful. You know, so you've got the, the heads, but no handles. Um, and you may be wondering if I can't punch down trees, how do I get sticks? Like that. Yep. You get sticks and saplings this way. That's the only way. And I'm going to need quite a few of these, so pardon me while I beat on trees a little bit here. 
Um, and there is no leaf decay, by the way. Um, you can't just, um, you know, wait for the leaves to decay. It, it, it won't happen. Here, I'll need these. I'll need those. And I'll need these. All right. That's a good starting point. By the way, do I? Ooh, that's weird. Okay, I don't have inventory tweaks. I need, need to install inventory tweaks. Um, I'll get on that here in a minute. I need to stay back where they are. Okay. Um, there are other changes. You can notice that my health and hunger bars are different. Um, that they're, they're now bars instead of discrete little units. Um, that's because the health, uh, your health is uh, 1,000 versus 10. Um, and so are the mobs, for that matter. They're much, much higher. Um, you'll see that. However, the damage you do is also greater. Um, although, note that my stone knife only does 75. And these guys do 45. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> stone tools just really suck. So, what do we got here? Schist. I won't make the obvious joke there. Um, and you also have a little blue bar, which is your thirst. Um, you can't get you to get thirsty. You can either go here and stand in water, or you can make jugs later on. So that's how that works. All right. And let's go further into our adventures of uh, how badly stone tools suck. Note that I this is a, this is an axe, but yeah, this is gonna take ages. And it should be also noted that even though it does cut down the entire tree, please note you don't get any of the leaves or saplings off the any um, saplings or sticks from the leaves that disappear. So heh 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 crap. And you only get 90% of the logs, too, which is kind of sad, but stone tools, they really suck. What can I say? All right, we're going to go ahead and collect some more rocks. It's getting dark. Um, by the way, do I have it on normal? Good enough. Now, um, you notice I don't, I didn't want to say my stone tools, there's no such thing as a stone pickaxe. There isn't. Um, you can't go digging in the ground. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah, it's got a question. Uh, how cold is it? Temperature 490. 5 degrees Celsius. It's fairly, yeah, it, it's spring. You can see the date. It's early spring. Getting dark out here. Um, so I can't build out of stone. I can't build out of wood because there's no way to turn these logs into planks. Um, I can't build out dirt because, well, let me show you how you try building out dirt around here. For one, I don't know how the shovel takes a bit. I can get a shovel, but try that again. The moment you try building your walls, yeah, that. Yes, that, 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 that's what's known as bad, bad news. Bad, 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 bad news. So, the only thing you can really do... Um, this is one thing the extra th um, Firmacraft does help out, by the way. I can make um, Adobe bricks to build with. Um, and I'll do that tomorrow, I think. I'll show you how that works. But for now... Uh, let's go ahead and, there we go, oops, I'm still getting used to gaming on my laptop, I keep hitting my caps lock instead of my shift key, which is annoying, alright, yeah, so you can make thatch, I'll draw, and with thatch, you can actually make your very first uh, shelter, I can find a good spot, I think the island may be a good spot, not seeing any mobs over there, though, mm. I can't argue with that. <laughs> uh, that's one thing I do like about Terra Firma Craft. Um, the very first night is, is, is really darn terror is very darn terrifying uh, because 
you have no weapons that do much. You can't build a shelter. You definitely can't build a bed. Building a bed is doing something I'm going to get into, but let me just tell you, it's not fun. Um, so you're kind of really kind of praying. Oh, King's Blood. Nice. Uh, I'm not sure how this works. It's supposed to be able to. Ah, uh, well. Um, I suppose you use alchemy, but no, I'll get back to that in a minute. So, yeah, that very first night is, is really very terrifying. Um, apparently, it doesn't have a use. Guess what it did. See, that does something. Oh, well. It's useful now. I'd look it up. I don't. I don't know all the recipes. I don't know all what I'm doing. It's been. It's been a very long time since my last um, last minute video. And um, let me apologize in advance, by the way, for this. Um, I'm probably going to be a little bit rusty and a little bit. Oh crap. Okay. This is. This is. Let me show you this. He's at 900 health. <laughs> my knife does 75. Or more. Or more. If I do this. Oops. Back up. Get your knife. There we go. There we go. Oh, and uh, rotten flesh? Completely useless. You can't eat it. You can't do anything with it. It's just useless. Throw it on the ground. Um, yeah, basically the mob drops are, are the monsters aren't worth a thing in this thing. Um, outside the arrows from skeletons, I think. Anywho, uh, well, I'm kind of safe here on my own little island outside that one zombie. So this is I'm gonna. I'm actually not seeing that many monsters, actually. I'm not, you know, complaining at all, mind you. <laughs> not complaining a bit. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grab more of this dolomite. Um, yay. Might harvest down some more birch, because it's useful. Um... Well, sapling's only gotten from from leaves like get get a punch. Um, sustainable forestry has gotten a lot harder because the sapling drop has also been um, nerfed fairly heavily. And it's, this whole thing is fairly fairly hardcore um, for good or ill. <laughs> I like it, of course. It 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 does a lot of things I do like so. Oh, I wouldn't be playing it. Mind, it does suffer from the same... Eventually, it does suffer from the same problem that Minecraft always has. Eventually, the, the player's power curve overwhelms the mod. But unlike the base game, where you can get, you know, diamond armor and be done with it in like the very first hour or so of play, um, you're going to spend, like, a good day or so uh, working your way from being damn terrified at night to being worth anything at all. So, um, very, very much appreciated. Oh, it should be noted that when I cut down this tree, watch the durability of my ax. It, it, it drops by one for every, um, every log in the tree. Um, so, you know, you're not getting free chop downs off this thing. You're, you're still paying durability. Though you're still not getting all the, the logs back from the... Which is kind of bad, but... Alright, we're getting, we're getting a lot of wood here. This is good. I need... I need wood. Um, I need lots of wood, actually. Um, you'll see why here in a minute. Uh, 
uh, this is just the start of my uh, my epic quest. Oops. Well, so much for that axe. That did not work at all. I hate when that happens. Let's try that again. That got it. All right. How much of these? Oop. We have daylight. Daylight come. All right. Well, I'm going to continue to deforest this, this island here. My next goal will be um, locating, see, uh, you really need metal tools where you can get anywhere. Um, but you kind of need metal tools to get the ore you need to get metal, sort of. It's kind of a, a chicken and the egg pro, chicken or the egg problem. Um, luckily, there is a solution. Um, it's occasionally, when you turn over these rocks here, you'll get um, ore instead of a rock. So... Uh, we just gotta get lucky. <laughs> because what I need is copper. Uh, copper is your very first tool or There we go. And I don't think dolomite is, has any copper in it. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to go um, go on an adventure, as it were, see if I can go find copper. Yeah, the uh, Terra Firmacraft progression has just changed recently. It used to be you make tools out of any kind of ore you can find, um, but now the very, the, your very first, your surface ores are um, uh, bismucinite. Um, well, it's, it's, it's zinc, it's zinc, tin, and um, copper, and you can only make tools now out of copper, which is less than useful sometimes. Um, so, oh, dead zombie. All right. So I kind of need to go, I'm looking for, well, um, basalt would be nice. I think granite does too, I think. Um, oh, zombie. Burn. Zombie. Yep, carrots. Yay. Turn it off again. And carrot seeds, which is also useful. Arguably more useful than the carrots themselves, right to me right now. Um Yep, I need I need clay too. Clay is very useful. What do we got here? Ooh. Yellow bells and green bell peppers. Awesome. More seeds. More seeds for farming. That's gonna be fairly damn well. That's gonna be fairly fairly damn awesome here in a minute. Just as soon as I, I can also stand to find uh, sheep. Am I still in Mr. Um, Dolomite's world here? Yep. Uh, am I going, I probably should go this way. I really should be going this way. Um, yeah. Really, it's kind of a, a, a puzzle, is what I got. What I should say, I got a puzzle here. Very puzzling. Um, all right, yeah. Maybe heading south. Um, north, north and south actually have a latitude now. And negative 14,000 does put me very close to the fairly northern end of things. So I really do need to head south. Um, 
it is it is kind of hard um, to do any kind of farming because it will snow in the winter and if you're too far north it will kind of ruin your crops ruin the hell out of your crops so if it snows I don't know if you can make greenhouses or not in this game. Ugh, this is just lovely. Of course, going any kind of south is going to be a pain. That's, that's the that, that's the mountain that I took shelter on. Night. Oh, this is just lovely. Sometimes you, you, you get kind of screwed for your starting area. And I think I got screwed. I could put down some sluice. Um, and, and try to see if I can uh, pan for gold or pan for you know, pan for copper actually not gold um, but that doesn't strike me as as very useful all right yeah we're going over this way Ugh. oh it should be noted too if you can, um, I, the, the uh, sea level here is 144 there's additional 40 um, plus the dedicated underground in this game. Uh, the whole mining thing has gotten a lot more elaborate. A lot. So this should be a schist. That's that schist rock, yes. I don't know what kind of comes in schist, but I guess I'll find out. Schist. Again, I will refrain from making the obvious joke. Um, this guy may end up, oh, no, wait. <laughs> I say, am I going to run out of um, land here? But no. Schist. Oh. Red bell peppers. <laughs> I got yellow. I got carrots. I got, I got a nice little smorgasbord. Oh, wait. I am going to run out. Darn it. Okay, let's go this way. Um... See if I still am in schist land. Yep, schist land. Schistlandia. Whoa, hello. Tetrahedra, tetrahedrite. That's, that's either, uh, that either contains zinc or tin. I forget which. Um, uh, you got zinc, you got tin, and then you get uh, bismuth as well. Uh, none of which does me much good because you can't make tools out of them. Tetrahedrite. I've heard this. Uh, that's either zinc or tin that they control. I can never remember which one it is. Um, it's useful. Um, you can add, you make an alloy with um, copper to make, I, I think, bronze. So it'll be useful later, even though it's not useful now type of thing. It's good to know it's here, but it doesn't mean doing much good in my, in my immediate situation. And you can also tell them I'm a bit far north because you notice there's not even any, any kind of animals. Um, yeah, that kind of, that that's, what happened here? <laughs> All right, that's kind of a square tree. Um, it looks like, it looks like I might do some swimming. That's highly unfortunate. Aha! Clay! We've got clay. That's kind of nice, actually. Give me a minute. All right. I'll collect me some clay. Uh, first off, let's go ahead and get me a shovel. As before we bang a couple of rocks together, boom, shovel. Mount the shovel on a stick. Boom. Shovel. All right, let's see here. Boom, boom, boom. Yep. Um, you see, the very first bits of metal you get, um, unlike, um, Normal Minecraft, where you, you heat the thing in a furnace to make the oil. Here, you actually have to make a, a, a pit kiln. Um, and you actually cast the metal instead of um, for, um, melting it. 
and the ingots and using it like that. It's a kind of fascinating process. And that was a very small pocket of, of clay. Eh, it'll do. Ugh. Yeah, we're not we're not doing so hot. It's gonna be another long night. I I, I have a problem. from me. I can just tell already. Here, let's go ahead and grab some more straw. Gotta make more thatch. Because I got very, very lucky that first night. I don't know if I can keep being that lust that lucky. Hello, what's that? Am I back in Dolomite land? Is this what this is? Is this more dolomite? Yep. More dolomite. I don't know what if any men each type of rock has its own um, different ores that can be in it. And I don't know if dolomite actually has anything worthwhile. So being out here in dolomite land just, just doesn't mean it do me any good at all. So okay, we're back here in Schistville again. Schist I, I swear there's more more types of, of you know. Oh, that's something new. Quartzite. Really? Ugh. Well, that's just useless. Uh, I don't think there's any ore at all in quartzite. And since it's more or less, it's like glass fragile too, so. Yeah, this is going from bad to worse. And now it's getting dark, which is just. <sighs> Lovely. I'll just say for the record, I hate this start. I hate it lots. I hate it lots and lots. Lots and lots and lots. All right, let's see if I can find a nice spot to set up camp for the night. <laughs> As I try to find, um, you know, anything that's worthwhile. Hey, pigs! Hey, guys! All right, we're going to go out here and camp with the pigs. That sounds like a plan. Awesome. Oh, that's weird. Get over here. There we go. I've got myself 20 thatch. It is really damn dark. Uh, let me go ahead and see if I can. We kind of want a flat spot so I could, uh, but apparently I'm not going to get it. So we're going to quickly go over here and go, hi. Oh, crap. Oh crap! Go away! Spider with too many darn hit points. And my damn knife broke. Alright. Their knife. Where's his butt? There it is. Really? Where are you? He's, he's up the tree. Well, balls. What do I do with that now? Oh, now there's a skeleton, too. All right. Oh, well, this is not going well. How the thatch? They don't really particularly have a secure compound. It's somewhat secure, but not as secure as I'd like it to be. Oh, look at this! That's an armor well. That's an, that's a, that, that, that's a that's a wither skeleton, I think. Also known as really bad news. I 
I need more thatch. More thatch. Less zombies. I don't, don't think I don't see you. All right. There we go. See, so I can go ahead and. There! Sort of secure. Not really. There. Safe or anything with it, but the damn spider, wherever the damn spider is. And I'm going to go ahead and eat me a yellow bell pepper. There we go. All right. Now, do I have anything here that really I can stand to? Um, really no, I guess. Um, I could stand to have a roof, but that really is not going to happen right now. Uh, that spider is just stuck up that tree. It's fine. He can be up that tree all he likes. I'm, I'm perfectly fine with him being up that tree. Um, honestly. Uh, let's go ahead and eat a carrot too while I'm here. Well, that's less than useful. Yep, less than useful. Oh, man. So, one other night of just kind of sitting here going, yeah, waiting for bad stuff to happen. Um, tell you what, I'll go ahead and cut the video here, and we'll come back in the morning and see what's going on, all right? Um, see you guys in a bit, okay?